Well, hello there. This is Skip McCoy for Riversoft University. This segment is about exporting Oasis. It's this button right here on the blueprint. This feature creates an Oasis file to submit to CMS. Only those Oasis records whose payment sources are included in this list, Medicare Traditional, Medicare HMO, Medicaid Traditional, and Medicaid HMO, are included in the list. Patients must be 18 years or older in order to be eligible for export, so they're not in the list either. But other than that, um, we will generate a list of OASIS by lock date range, by office. By, normally, we're going to use all assessment types. Status is locked. We're going to ignore affiliation right now and build a list. We've got one out there. Uh, the, the payer column right here shows the payer related to the 45 corresponding to the OASIS. This can be helpful for exposing 45s that are linked to an incorrect payer. If the payer listed in the column is not Medicare, Medicare Advantage, or a Medicaid payer, it probably means the care plan is missing or set to the wrong payer. If an OASIS is associated with multiple care plans for different payers, only the first payer is listed. For each OASIS, we show the patient name, admission date, reason for the assessment, doc number, correction number, specification version number, completion date, the status, lock date exported, and the date of the OASIS. Okay, to create a export file for this OASIS, or multiple OASIS, I just highlight all the OASIS I need to, click export, I'm going to get a little report that tells me, there's the file I'm creating, here's the report that tells me what OASIS I exported, and then if I go to the OASIS export file, there's the file I created. That's how simple it is to create an OASIS export file. You can create an OASIS export file with one OASIS in it or a thousand. Okay, now that is exported right there. Okay, things go wrong though, and you might need to correct an OASIS that you have sent to CMS. Okay, that's a little more complicated, but it's all explained in the I button. If you need to send a correction, first you need to determine is your correction to one of the key fields. What's a key field? Well, these are the key fields. Let's pretend I just made a mistake on the question about vision that I wanted to correct. I would go through here and see if vision is one of the key fields. Start a care date, resumption of care date, patient name, social security name, social security number, birth date, gender, info, completed date, assessment reason, uh, discharge, transfer, death date, and correction number. Nope, vision has nothing to do with the key field. Goody. All I have to do is send a correction file. Okay, how do I do that? Well, check the current correction number of the OASIS using the OASIS editor. If the correction number is zero, increment it to the next sequential number. Make all the corrections needed. Change the OASIS back to lock and save it. Then I'm going to come back here and export it. Well, that sounds simple. I can do that. Let's try that. Okay, so this is the medical record for Daisy Wolf. Here's the Oasis. Okay, it's locked, so I'm going to have to put it back to completed in order to get to the correction number. I'm going to increment that, save it, and now I need to actually change the value. And that was a sensory value, so I'm going to put it in use, go to sensory, there's the thing I wanted to change and save it. Okay, now I just got to get it back to locked. Locked. I think I did it. Okay, so I'm going to go back here. And it's locked. I got a correction number of one. I got my correction in there. It can't be that simple. Click the export button. There's my new file. Okay, there's what's in the file. Wow, I just generated a correction file. That was pretty simple. Well, that should be all you need to know in order to create OASIS export files and correction files. If you get lost, go to that I button. It'll lead you right through the whole process. I thought that was pretty simple. Well, this is Skip McCoy signing off for Riversoft University.